As much as foreign direct investment is a prerequisite for sustainable economic growth, President Gengob cautions against this being interpreted as a sign of desperation. This follows increasing threats of workforce reductions by some multinational companies and foreign investors, creating uncertainty among the country's workforce. President Gengob says government's aim in negotiating with foreign investors is for a win-win outcome, including respecting of local labor laws. Swapo Party Secretary General Sophia Shaningwa delivered to the president's speech at the May Day celebrations in Ventuk. The problem is that some, if not all, foreign investors come on their own terms. We must say to it that all foreign investors who come here must come on the Namibian terms. Namibia is a sovereign nation and Namibians have endured immeasurable suffering to achieve their freedom. Thus, it is incumbent, incumbent on all foreign investors in Namibia to respect the dignity and integrity of the citizens of this country, most specifically our workers. Another reality that Namibian workers must face is the looming fourth industrial revolution characterized by technology. But fear not, the president says. Although we are currently on the cusp of one of the greatest leaps in human technological advancement, one thing remains constant. No economy in the world can survive without the human element that comes with the form of our working men and women. Therefore, let us not fear the fourth industrial revolution. Rather, let us embrace it by preparing our workers to remain at the forefront of this innovation. The Workers' Day was celebrated under the theme Workers Unite Against Corruption for Good Corporate Governance and Sustainable Employment. Blanche Corres, NBC News.